Okay, guys. It's it's me, um, Alyssa Steel Lion. I'm back again. Um, and today, I know you guys might notice this is a little different than normal. But I can't get on the computer these days. Um, so... I'm honestly just gonna do this. Um, anyway, so um, I've been getting comments um from my new subscriber her name, um, and she says um she's been telling me great job, good videos. She also says um please make more videos. I want to enjoy I I enjoy the ones you've made so far. Thank you so much, Thunder Runder AG. Um, I know you have a YouTube channel, so that anybody here, I I would like for you guys to go subscribe to her. She's so nice i'm so glad you enjoy them and today i mean it's not exactly star stable but today um i've decided to be reacting to some old star stable stuff and i also i think what my main thing today is going to be picking out a new horse to buy on star stable which horse i should buy next um so i guess we should just look that up horses from star stable Yes, and I am on my iPad. So, I'm not... You're going to hear, like, the clicking sounds. And I'm just going to go through and look at some horses, I guess. Um, see which ones are... I Guys, I mean, honestly, they're not the best. But I have always wanted the Yorvik Wild Horses. Like, the big ones, these ones, um, I love them a lot. I don't know why, I just really always have loved them. Um, I also enjoy the Mustangs, which I have the SSO Horses app, um, and I've grown my Mustang up, and I have the gray and white paint Mustang. Um, oh jeez, I just realized I have no way to get back now. Oh, wait, here. There we go. And I grew that horse, so I've been saving up, but, like, obviously I'm not good at saving up, so I've just been buying stuff, and I planned, it depends, I don't know, I haven't been on SSO for weeks, I don't know, maybe, like, I don't know how long it's been, maybe, like, two weeks? Three weeks? Um, so I'll probably have, I think, 500 star coins, something like that, um, so I will be able to buy... At least a horse. I'm not sure, but I'm not going to waste my money like I did on my pony. Um, new horse guide. So, anyway, I'm doing this video because I know Thunder Runner is going to, wants me, Thunder Runner, right? Yes. Thunder Runner, I know, is a big fan. So, I wanted to do something for her. Him, her. Don't exactly... No, sorry. It's a mistake in anything. Um, so that's basically why I'm doing this. And also, just so I can kind of ask some things. So. Oh, and it looks like... Okay, sorry about that. Um, weird cut off. Some girl commented on my video. Um, her name was Lily or G or whatever. She commented saying don't like it. She disliked it. I don't really care. I don't mind her opinion, but she's like, oh, she, she said something mean to me and so on and so forth. And then I was like, I literally just told her that she clearly didn't know that horses need to be, because she, she was commented on the guy's video. He was desensitizing this one horse. And it, it was a good method because, method because, um, the horse, it's, it's good to desensitize the horse, it's not like he was hitting the horse or anything, he was just crackling a bag around him, dropping a bucket, make sure, see, make, desensitize the horse, and I just, and she's like, guys, like this, get up to 50 likes if you think that this is horse abuse, and walking your horse is bad, like he was doing, and so on and so forth, and she, he was like showing him the horse cows and stuff, but she was like acting like walking a horse was the huge, biggest crime, and then she like, Oh my gosh, she's just weird. She's like, I, and then she's like, oh, actually, I know everything about horses. I hope, I hope you don't. And I was just like, 
what? And then she goes onto my YouTube page, and then she went on the Gold Souls training videos, and then she's like, something, don't like this video, she said something mean, I removed it, because I don't take hate on my channel, I don't really, you know, I don't care, great, she's my first dislike, dislikes gotta be dislikes, and I gotta learn how to take it, but honestly, she, and then, she, and then I was, and I kind of, I was like, but I ride horses, and I've owned three before, and I was just like, are you kidding me? <laughs> anyway, guys, um, I found this guide, um, it's got the prices and stuff on it, um, so I either want this Morgan right here, or I would like, oh jeez, let me get this, or this really cute dapple gray thoroughbred, I don't think I have Crescent Moon Village yet, um, I also would like this black one, or one or the other, um, you guys have to let me know though, um, which one you would get, either the thoroughbred or the, um, Morgan, but I really like the thoroughbred, because it reminds me of a horse I used to have, um, I think actually, I've, yeah, I've owned horses before, so I've had a couple in total, and it reminds me of this one horse I used to own, Rocky, he was old, um, he didn't do much after a while, like, he, I had him for a little bit, he was more just a flat horse, um, and I was, I rode him, and he, um, was just the sweetest thing, and that horse looks so much like him, honestly, like, right here, you can't really see the actual details and colors, but on Star Stable, they're really cute and pretty, so, um, I would really like to have that horse, um, except they're 890, 890 Star Coins, I don't know if I have that many yet. Um, honestly, that gray thoroughbred might be a little too much. Um, they also look like... The only thing, though, about them is that they kind of look kind of bulky in the shoulders and in the hinds. And their legs are kind of thick because they're thoroughbreds and they should have muscle there. Um, the Morgans, the only thing about them, I guess, is what they're like pony size. So they're kind of hard to ride I want to say but I'm not sure if their speed's the same I, I'd have to look um let me see the Morgan was once considered the ideal horse for the United States Calvary Cal Calvary <laughs> it is named after the owner of the first known horse in the line who was called Justin Morgan Morgan bloodlines have played a part in the development of many American breeds for instance the standard standard bred American bred and the Tennessee walking horse um I don't really know. I, I, I get, it doesn't say anything like a disclaimer about them being half the size. So, hold on, guys. Let me find some more information on the Morgans. Okay, so I found this image of an English thoroughbred, which is on the right, versus the Morgan horse on the left. They're not too different in size. Um, the Morgan horse is a little shorter than the English thoroughbred, and it's got a cuter face, I want to say, but the English thoroughbred, I know, is taller clearly um the morgan horse looks like it's got no meat the thoroughbred has it but i i like both of them they're so cute <laughs> everyone finds the chestnut ones cute but i i don't know i need to buy a dressage horse guys and that'd probably be my english thoroughbred um i don't plan to buy the hanoverians i just don't really like their style no hates on them i just don't really like them specifically but um whatever oh and here's an image of the dapple gray horse he's oh it would clear the photo would focus there it is um i'm pretty sure that's a ferris jacqueline photo no 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 that's not ferris jacqueline that looked like ferris jacqueline that's the dressage ring i'm pretty sure yeah that's the riding ring um but I really love the style. The look of that horse is just so pretty. It, it reminds me so much of Rocky, um, that horse I had. He's it's 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 so cute. I just love the color. I don't know why. It's just something. But then again, training the horses when that's why I hate buying new horses. It's because one, I lose my star coins and I have to wait the weeks because I don't buy star coins. Um, 
and two is because when you first get them they're always so slow like so freaking slow until you get them up to speed up to level which I, I train well I mean getting up to like level five is easy it takes I have so many races I could get that done within like probably a week even less probably like more like three days but that's always the problem is to have to like level them up um I think next I'm gonna go review some horse tech I'm gonna show you the tech that I want what are you doing? okay Okay, so I'm sorry for if you heard my mom come in. She didn't know what I was doing. I didn't tell her I was recording, so she kind of interrupted. Um, anyway, so here's... I searched up SSO horse tech, so they're clearly going to be on the horses. Um, I didn't specify English or Western. <sighs> hmm. Okay, well anyway, um... That was a weird yawn. Um, my horse... The horse tech that I tend to like is is I kind of like um I don't like to match my outfits I don't really care about the outfits I like the tack though for the tack to match um let's see what I can look up um SSO horse tack the dressage set which I love the dressage set it's um in in Yorvik City I'm not sure I think I think it's in Yorvik City and of course, no dressage set comes up whatsoever, except for that one, and that's an old model. Um, hey, my butt. Okay, well, the dressage set, yeah, kind of looks like this real tech photo. It actually honestly has that saddle and saddle pad and that bridle, like, it all matches up. I have a black bridle, but I don't know. I didn't show you guys my white bridle that I'm wearing because it's got speed on it. And I've always just liked the white bridle. Plus, I just wanted to get it to an even 200 star coins, so I just bought it. Um, but anyway, that's a close relative of what the actual tax set from Star Stable looks like. So that's what I kind of would like. Okay, guys, thank you all so much for watching today. This turned out to be a pretty long video. Probably most of you guys didn't watch the whole things. But, um, anyway, um, I have to say thank you so much to Thunder Runner AG. Thank you for enjoying my videos. Thank you for watching them. I know you have been, because you've been, uh, my notifications keep saying that you keep watching. And I'm so glad you're here. I just started this YouTube video. Maybe you'll be one of those people that'll stick to me with me for over the years if I can maintain this YouTube channel um which I really hope I can I, I enjoy it but my um, mother's computer is getting slow so SSO is probably on pause every once in a while now instead of going every single week because it's a little hard for me to do them on a slow computer and until I get my own computer I guess I'm gonna be in tough tough position until I get like screen recorders um, I mean, my school's passing out Chromebooks soon, but that's probably not going to work. Um, I love making videos. I love the support. Um, and as you can see, I literally just p did this today because it says one hour ago in the comment. And literally, yeah, that was an hour ago um, that I read that comment. And I always check YouTube every day. I'm always on it. So um, I always know, basically, and I have notifications on, so I'll know. And I'm just... So happy you enjoy that, um, my videos and my content, and I am I'm, I'm so glad. <laughs> I can't I can't express how happy I am. Um, face cam, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that anytime in the future, but you got you can give me you can give me comments on if you want me to do face cam. I don't think I'm going to because I can't. I mean, right now I have I probably could on this app particularly but I don't really know it's it's kind of I don't like doing face cam but you guys can leave comments let me know if you want me to do face cam so on and so forth but anyway guys thank you so much for watching maybe this channel will grow maybe it won't but even if it doesn't I'll probably most likely upload um, I won't have a regular schedule yet um, but just thank you all f so much for watching. Thank you for the support. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.